During bitumen extraction from oil sands ore, an aqueous mixture of fine silts, hydrocarbons, and soluble organic compounds called oil sands tailings is produced. Naphthenic acids are the primary toxic component of these oil sands tailings. Due to their chemical structure, they resist degradation and present a long-term environmental hazard. By 2025, the total volume of tailings is expected to equal 1 billion cubic meters. My project idea involved using slow sand filtration technology to biodegrade these naphthenic acids. Invented in 1804, slow sand filters clean water by developing a biofilm on top of a bed of sand. Despite their ability to promote biological growth, according to the literature, slow sand filters have never been used to biodegrade naphthenic acids. In my experiment, I set out to change this. The objective of my project was to design, construct, and investigate the use of slow sand filters newly applied as bioreactors to the degradation of toxic naphthenic acids. I hope that the biofilms in my sand bioreactors will break down these difficult naphthenic acids much faster than normal. In order to conduct my experiment, I first designed an original bench scale set of slow sand filters. Using actual bacteria from oil sands tailings ponds, the naphthenic acid breakdown in my sand bioreactors was then measured compared to bioreactors that only contained planktonic cells. Epifluorescence microscopy indicated that the biofilms that I was hoping for actually grew around the sand particles in my bioreactors. In one week, the planktonic cell bioreactors only removed 38% of the naphthenic acids, while my sand bioreactors broke down 92%, an average of two and a half times faster. According to my results, 400 Olympic swimming pool sized sand bioreactors could potentially break down the naphthenic acids in all of the existing oil sands tailings free water in less than 20 years. With oil sands development only expected to accelerate in the future, the significance of my findings is the discovery of a sustainable way to decrease the detoxification of the tailings ponds from centuries to decades.